Hey everybody, welcome to Giraffe Town. Yeah. Uh, ugh, I don't even know how to describe this game. We're a giraffe looking for love. Uh, I don't have any save data. Yeah, I don't know how to describe this game other than... Where's the lonely giraffe? We might be slightly creepy. Just slightly. So I've wanted to play this for a while. I actually wanted to record this with, with uh, John Wolf for Shit or Treat. But we never got around to it. So I'm just going to do a solo. So this has a very uh, Silent Hill vibe, as you can see. Save cutscene? No. Aw, that's a magazine called Love. Is he looking at porn in the park? My name is Giraffe. Oh, okay. Husband of slippery feet. Oh no! Excuse me, mister! Hey, mister! You need to look down, buddy. You're a little, you're a little necky. Who said that? <laughs> I don't know what voice I'm gonna give him. Who says I have to give him a voice? Who says? Over here, behind you! Oh god. Whoa! What do you want, kid? I'm trying to do the intro to the game here. Oh god. Intro? For the game? So it's gonna break the fourth wall on me? Yeah, you know. Like, give some backstory for my character, or about my character. Huh? Never mind. Whoa! You just get get out of here. <laughs> You're in the shot. Can you please help me with something, Mister. Is your face stuck to the fence? Okay, fine. Make it quick. God, we are weebly and wobbly. You get my ball for me. Kicked it all the way over there! Oh, jeez. I'm too afraid to get it myself! And you're stuck to the fence. It's really dark and I don't like the dark! Why are you even here at the park <laughs> this late at night? I keep trying to like, give him a voice. I'm trying to figure it out. Wait, this is a park? Why are you sitting there looking at the fence? I feel like I'm get, kind of getting to like a goofy, gouache kind of territory with them. Turn around and face me. Oh, no thanks. I'm fine like this. What kind of beautiful face do you have? All right, kid. You're being very rude. If only get your ball, turn around and talk to me. Okay, okay, sheesh. Oh. Whoa! <laughs> Where the hell's your face? I really am getting into like a goofy territory with it. Oh um, well. It's not I'm not really an important character in the game. Oh. My face wasn't designed. This is really just a tutorial level. What? <laughs> just go get my ball! Uh, alright buddy, it's me and you. Gently push the analog stick forward to carefully move your feet. Whoa. I am, oh my god, I am skatey. Holy shit. God damn it, okay. So I need to be gentle about it. Can I? Oh god. Oh my god, here, do I need to use keyboard and mouse with this? Okay, keyboard and mouse is definitely better. Oh my god, he has slippery feet. Slippery... Easy? Easy? Don't rush it. 
<laughs> Does he have? Oh! oh! <laughs> it's it's definitely a lot easier with keyboard. I feel like I have a little more control over him, but he's still just so slippery. And what what do giraffes have? Do they have hooves? Is that what they're still called? These weird little moose knuckle for feet. <laughs> oh. Okay. Got a slippery. Almost there. Slippery giraffe. Ugh. Take the soccer ball. Yeah, take it. Oh, I have to walk all the way back now. Okay. I was gonna pick up the controller. Okay, easy. Doing fine. <laughs> oh no! Shit! <laughs> Where does it put me? Do I have to do it again? Okay, good. Uh, what am I supposed to do about that now? Oh, it's back, okay. Okay, so is this the one that falls? Okay, there we go. Oh. Physics, how's that staying up? So far, so good. Oh, God. Oh, it's so slippery. No! I barely touched it! I barely touched it! I knew I could do it. Why am I making him a hillbilly? All right. I knew I could do it. Hey, kid, I got your... Whoa! He slip. Now he's going to drop it. <laughs> my ball! I guess it'd be like, my ball! That's hard to do. Oh. Fuck. <laughs> Tragic. Absolutely heartbreaking. All right, buddy. You wanna get up? That kid's gonna kill him. Way to go, jackass. You're welcome. Please don't kill me. He's sad in the picture. No. <laughs> Amazing intro for a game. Fantastic. <laughs> Are giraffes like the embodiment of depression or something? Because wowee, he looks glum. a painting of myself with multiple heads staring down a road. Don't you? Getting like super Silent Hill vibes from it and I really appreciate it. I really dig it. And then there's the fucking giraffe just sitting there. No giraffe town. I have no idea how long this game is by the way. I'm gonna try to do a full playthrough. I've sectioned off a sizable portion of my day just to play this. Here I am. Sitting at home watching TV. 
Listen, that's all I would do every day. Hey Mike, when, when you edit this, flip that audio so I can tell what it's saying. Like anything exciting ever happens anyway. I can't really do much with these slip with these stupid slippery feet. I can't go anywhere without falling. Aww. You've tried wearing shoes? On my ass. <laughs> we recommend that you avoid going outside and always carry extra cans of would be gun spray at all times. Until next time, I am News Guy Number Three, signing off. The wooden stosis epidemic continues to take the lives of thousands on a daily basis. The wooden sucked population is growing at a rapid rate, and it is still unknown from where these disease infested insects have originated from. For those of you who are unaware, getting bit by a wood insect will effectively render you lifeless, causing your body to grow wood on top of your skin. You will quickly lose your motor skills as well as your vision, hearing, and other senses. Death is always immediate. One bite from a wood insect is highly fatal. We recommend that you avoid going outside and always carry extra cans of wood begun spray at all. And now, the moment you've all been waiting for! Seeing her new song, live from Samir Hills. Samir Hills? Ladies and gentlemen, give her a round of applause for the world famous pop musician. Love, aww. It's a lady giraffe. Thank you, thank you. Thank you. Okay. <laughs> Damn, she hot. Hi everyone, I'm Love the Giraffe. You sure are. Very excited to sing my newest song, Get Back Up. Is that about our giraffe? It's for all the people who've been feeling down in their lives. <laughs> Look at him! When you're feeling down Yeah All you gotta do is Get back up! Yeah! Get back up! Get back up, yeah, get back up. It's okay to fall, it's okay to fail. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> All you gotta do is try again. All you gotta do is get back up, yeah, get back up. Man, I love this song. Love is my favorite singer ever. <laughs> Her song spoke to me. <laughs> I like how uh, the shadow from the lettering is getting farther away. Love's music. Oh. Get back up. Yeah, get back up. Damn, she's got moves. And a booty. <laughs> These are the only lyrics to the song. Get back up. Yeah, get back up. Damn, she's amazing. Where can I where can I stream her stuff now? Is she on Spotify? Thank you everyone, thank you. Uh tonight I'll be available on at the other side of town. I'll be signing autographs, taking photos, and meeting fans, and just having fun. The other side of town? That's just down the road from me. Don't be shy, come and meet me! Be there at the other side of town for tonight only. Do I have to like cross a bunch of beams and scary shit to get to the other side of town? I'm very excited to hang out with all my wonderful fans. See you soon. Bye. <laughs> Love is coming here. Too bad I can't go. Just get back up. Yeah. Dumb feet. <laughs> I wish I could go. 
Might, might be the only chance I'll ever get to meet her. <laughs> I love you. Just get back up! Seriously, get the fuck up. Wait, you know what? Why not? Why can't I go? What's holding me back? If I fall, all you gotta do is... Get back up! Too many times I've said no to life. All because I was afraid of falling. Well, you know what? These slippery feet aren't gonna hold me back anymore. And I'm gonna walk down that road. Meet love and get her autograph. Aw. Do I get to play now? Oh, these my... Oh. Okay. I figure, like, in rooms like this, I can use the controller to be fine. Okay. Nothing there. There is something on the answering machine. There we go. <laughs> uh, maybe not? Oh, this is my backyard. Where's your bedroom, dude? Okay, I guess we're... Oh, God. Yeah, the all the roads are... Oh. The phone is ringing. I should go back and answer. Whoa! <laughs> answer phone, yes. Hello? 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 Anyone there? Hello? Oh, can you hear me? We're outside. What? Who is Who is this? Hello? We are watching you. Very funny. I don't have time for this. Bye. Don't... Who is this? Shut up. We'll do as we say. Right now. You'll wait inside of your house until midnight. If you try to... Oh, fuck. If you try calling the police, we will kill you. We will call you back in three hours for further instructions. The portal to the beast opens at midnight. What? Sacrifice. So I wonder if there's an ending if I just, like, stay here. Oop. Okay, I guess I'm waiting for midnight. Okay. I don't see a portal. Hello? Okay. Next. You'll go over to- fuck, I need to stop hitting A. You can access the portal. Hi! You will not ask any questions. You will get into the portal. You will go through your TV. Please! Do it! Okay. God, I like how I'm, I'm just like, whoa, constantly. Let's do it! Uh, you say through the TV? Uh, I'm locked inside my own house. Hi. Enter the portal. Buddy, you're getting hypnotized. This is so bizarre. Like, this is just really, really weird, and I love it. Okay.
I feel like I just watched like an old French horror film from the 80s. What the fuck? I agree. Ooh. What's? Ooh. Who sprayed ketchup all over my house? <laughs> the. It's gotta be ketchup, right? Nope. It's not ketchup. That's not ketchup. Definitely not ketchup. Okay. So that was one of the most bizarre things I've seen in a video game. Oh, cool. Now everything is... I don't think... I don't think I'm in Samer Hills anymore. If I was capable of jumping, I could probably get up there. Okay, so I can't jump yet. So we're definitely in the Rust version of Samra Hills, I believe. <laughs> Make that sound stop, please. Uh, so how do I get the ability to jump?
Hmm. Neat. I can't figure out how to jump. Like, I know it's X button. I looked up the controls. I just can't figure out how to get the ability, and I can't figure out what to do. Okay. <laughs> Whatever. Okay, so let's let's not answer the phone. Let's let's go forward. Okay. Okay, gotta go back to keyboard and mouse for this part. Okay. We got it. We got it. It's fine. I wonder if I learn how to jump back here. God, he's so slippery. Shrippery feet. <laughs> I have to like concentrate on this so hard. What a silly game. Okay, so far so good. I don't know where that ending is. Watch this like loop me back around. It's like, no, answer your phone. I also want to try to... Uh, go and answer the phone, then leave whenever they tell me not to. Instead of sitting there like a good boy. Also, what was that cutscene about? Like, <laughs> what kind of nightmare was that? No! I wonder how far back that's gonna put me. Oh, so I have... Okay, so I have chances. Okay. Alright. Mike, cut to the end. Hey, I got a checkpoint. So now if I die, I'll come back there? Also appreciate the music. That's very nice of them. I'm, I'm definitely getting some, like, Silent Hill, like, save room vibes. Or, like, maybe, like, a Resident Evil safe room. You know, I don't hate it. Lovely day. Yes, lovely. Beautiful day for a stroll. raining now. Oh, and I got a checkpoint. Nice. I really want to know how long this thing is. Oh, and we're like kind of going uphill now. Okay. Son of a bitch! That light was too bright. I couldn't see the edge. Would be gone. <laughs> okay. 
Does it like, it looks like it sprays termites out. <laughs> I don't understand. Ooh. Oh good. Oh my god, I'm I'm focusing so hard on this right now. <laughs> okay. I haven't had I haven't hit a checkpoint in quite a while. Oh, thank god. Whew. Okay. Back to focusing. Relaxing. Nice mustache. I like it. Okay, back to this nightmare.
That was a really bad wind sound. It sounds like somebody is going into the mic. Giraffe murder. Am I dead? Oh my god, what is this music? What is this music? Oh god, look at this. wanted posters for that dude. Okay. The road is going upwards and it's slanted right now, so I have to like fight against so much stuff just to get going forward. Wow, there's a lot of them now. This is different-ish. Oh my god, am I at the end? made it. I can't. Welcome to the other side of town. I can't keep going. My legs. I can't feel my legs. My goodness, that took forever. Oh my god. That took forever. Like forever, ever, forever, ever, forever, ever. Cool, I'm about to get picked up by the giraffe killer. Oh. 
Uh. What? What? Uh. <laughs> okay, come on. Like, some of the cutscenes just take too damn long. Too damn long. Oh, hi. All right, Drafty boy, let's go get some ice cream. Hello? Who's there? Gorsh. <laughs> huh. Okay. I don't have any money on me, I swear. Think you're getting robbed by an ice cream chuck? Or you just tell him to fuck off? Because you're not going to buy anything. It's fine, giraffe boy. It's fine. Boy! Who are you? I need to come up a different voice for him. <laughs> Who? Nope. Is this made by the same guy who did a uh, potato thriller? I'm getting the same vibes right now. Who? Uh -huh. Me? Uh -huh. It's me! Uh -huh. Tunnels! Uh -huh. The Clown! Uh -huh. I'm Tunnels the Clown! Uh -huh. Time? Uh -huh. Time Traveling Clown! Uh -huh. Tunnels the Time Traveling Clown! Uh -huh. Yes! Uh -huh. Yes! That sounds good. And Tunnels, the time traveling clown. Damn you and your dancey feet. Do, 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 do you. Do you want ice cream? Buddy, don't take ice cream from him. Go. Say something. Do something. These long, awkward pauses are killing me. I have plenty of ice cream in my truck. I really do. I I just want to go home. Please. Uh Draft boy, get the fuck up. Do you want an ice cream? Okay. Uh -huh. Yes. Uh -huh. Yes, wonderful. Nice, nice little cha cha. Uh -huh. I'll get you an ice cream. Uh -huh. I'm going to give you my ice cream. Yes! He's got some moves, damn. Come on, let's go to my truck! Buddy. That's where the ice cream is. This is it. I'm gonna die right here. Gorsh. This is what I get for leaving my house. 
Same. Are you, are you, are you ready for my ice cream? Please don't do this. Here you go. Whoa. Sorry, <laughs> I only have strawberry. This will give you all your energy back, Mr. Giraffe. Hi. I thought you wanted to kill me. I would never! You silly goose. Thanks, I'm wobbly as shit again. Thanks for the ice cream, I mean. Yes, no problem. I travel through space and time to make new friends. And you, Mr. Draft, are my new friend. What brings you here anyway, Mr. Giraffe? Why? I'm searching for love. Say it. Hmm. <laughs> Hold on a sec, I have a photo of love. Where do you keep it? Oh. I don't see no pockets in there. I've seen this giraffe anywhere around here? She's dead. The giraffe killer got her. Never mind. What was I thinking coming all the way out here? Well, I'd never be interested in, meeting, interested in meeting someone like me. I'm so stupid. I can't even walk right. <laughs> it's all because of these stupid slippery feet. Have you tried wearing shoes? That's what I said. Shoes? Yeah, shoes! Shoes like these ones! Am I gonna get shoes so I'm not so fucking slippery? You can wear them! On your feet! You can run and jump in them, yay! Really? And... The shoes are slip resistant. <laughs> no way! Can I try them on? You can keep them, Mr. Giraffe! <laughs> are you serious? Wow! <laughs> Thank you, Tunnels! Hope you can find your happiness, my friend. All right, bye, tunnels. Was that him time traveling? These fit great. I feel so balanced, so chill, so relaxed. Please don't honk every time I walk now. Hey, tunnels, how do I look? Tunnels? And like that, he's gone. Thank you. Is it gonna honk at me every time I walk now? You got clown shoes. 
You can move normally without sliding. How wonderful. Wearing these shoes will give you the ability to jump. Simply press the jump button to jump. Which button is that, you ask? Press different buttons. It's not that hard. You'll figure it out. Yeah! Hey, so I just came back. <laughs> I'm paused, and there's this little nightmare here. What the f- <laughs> Hi. Oh my god, looking for this? So I guess it opens the, the gate. This is the town key, and this is my yard. I'm not looking for any trouble. I'm just trying to find love. Wow, that bright light. Please, you gotta let me in. I ain't gotta do nothing, buddy. But I will give you an opportunity. I'm gonna hide this key. Find it and you can enter the town. Okay, sounds fair enough, dog. <laughs> Don't look. I'm gonna hide it. Don't look, okay? You're very good at hiding things. Look at him sauntering up to me. Okay. I hit it. You're kidding, right? You'll never find it. Are they gonna make me just walk behind him? I found it! <laughs> no! Whoa, my balls! By a dog. You cheated. Punk. Do you know who I am? I'm the big dog. This is my yard. Don't mess with me. I think he killed me. He kicked my ball so hard that I died. Sorry. And I got carried away. You okay down there? None of this was worth it. <laughs> I tried to find love. I really did. I think it's time I throw in the towel. I just want to go back home. Good job, dude. You broke him. Hey, come on, man. You don't really mean that. You can't just give up on your dreams like that. W what? You came all the way out here to find love, right? Not everyone can do that. You pursued your dream and it's impressive, man. You made it this far. You gotta follow through to the end, bro. <laughs> I believe in you. You just kicked me! <laughs> Awkward. I know. I'm sorry. It's just... <laughs> I didn't think you would actually find the key. No one has ever found it before. I 
Well, I'm really not that bad of a dog. <laughs> I want to see you succeed. Aw, thanks, buddy. Do you really mean that? Thanks. Let's start over. My name is Big Dog. I'm gonna hide this key somewhere. What? I just found it, though. You can find it again. You can go into town, okay? What? No, it's not fair. I already found it. Just give it to me. I want to succeed. I want to see you succeed, man. Look at his little butt go. Are you kidding me? <laughs> okay, I hit it. All right, buddy, let's go find it. <laughs> Hi. You say there's no way I'm gonna find it? Here it is. All right, I'm not gonna go back to him, because what if he kicks me in the balls again? I'm just gonna leave. Open town gate? Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> oh god. Alright, let's try this. Gotta be more careful. Fucking yikes. So some rocks are gonna fall. Okay. There we go, I did it. This isn't a town, this is a forest. Oh, never mind. <laughs> what up, you smooth fuck? Do da do da do. I'm just sitting here waiting for the bus. Boy, it sure is cold out tonight. that sound? Is it gonna be draft boy? The bus should be here any second now. Just wait it out. There's nothing out here. Silly me. <laughs> the timing on some of the dialogue is really, really, really gets me. Who's there? Hey, the big soccer ball. <laughs> ah! That guy's losing his mind. Whoa, 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 take it easy, man. Sorry, I didn't mean to startle you. Ah! <laughs> okay, seems like he's calming down a little bit. Oh, it's just a deer. What the fuck? Wow, his pupils. Whew, what a relief. <laughs> wow, I'm on edge today. Excuse me, sir. I'm a little lost and was wondering if you could help me out. I feel like I've lost Goofy and just went full country. Gorge. Oh, God. Duh. Look at how cute it is. 
Do you want a carrot? Oh. Sir, please. Have you seen this giraffe anywhere around here? Uh-oh. Um... Sir? <laughs> Wait. You can talk? Oh my god. Really don't like this guy's face. Giraffe buddy, leave. Oh, I get it now. You're trying to find your friend, right, buddy? Your dear friend? That was a joke, get it? Yeah, I'm looking for love. Please. Has this giraffe been here? Well. There isn't much left on the town, or left of the town. The flower shop is still up. And, um, I did see a house across the street from the flower shop. Your friend might be there. The flower shop is behind the fence. Or this fence, okay. Wait, what do you mean? What happened to the town? Yeah, this place has been falling apart ever since the sun started to die out. Pardon? Oh! You didn't hear? The sun has been slowly dying out. That's why it's been so cold and foggy lately. Hey! Sun stun the sun still does come up. It's not completely dead yet. But it's very, very dim. Haven't had a nice sunny day in a while. That's okay. I like to stay positive. I'm actually on my way to a friend's uh, wedding myself. I'm waiting for the bus. That's why. I'm here. At the bus stop. The house across the street from the flower shop. Love has got to be there. Thank you very much. You've been a major help. Uh. 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 Stop it. Fix your face. I can do different face expressions. Actually, I'm the only character in this game that has different facial expressions. <laughs> what? <laughs> okay, got hit by the bus. Oh! Yay, my bus is here. I'm off to the wedding now. Bye! <laughs> His foot broken? His entire leg looks jacked. That double tapping sound, the bring ding, ding, ding. Has been on loop since we've been here. I really want it to stop. Okay. Whoops. <laughs> so I said the uh 
flower shop is on the other side of the fence, huh? Take by video surveillance, okay. Let's see, is there anything over here? Uh, that's where I came from. All right, uh... No idea how I'm supposed to... Oh no. Uh, hmm. Oh, okay. I'm really glad I can I can control how I walk now. That has been a major help. Yeah, I think it wants me to go in there. Uh alright. Just do it. Maybe not. It sounds scary in there. Sweet, I got her flowers. Okay, don't want to rob the register. Good boy. I would. The flower shop. Okay, now it said that there was a... A house. This is it. Love has got to be in here. Aw, look at him. He's ready for his date. Okay, deep breath. You can do this. Just be yourself. Let's go. <laughs> Cute. This is so exciting. I can't believe I'm going to meet love. Something tells me that's going to be the giraffe killer, dude. Pet his little face, his little muzzle. I want to pet his lips. Looks so cute. All these different camera angles. <laughs> I, feel like, I really just feel like I'm playing like a French horror film or something. It's totally where the draft killer lives. Like, I'm not an idiot. Uh oh. Uh. He's wearing her head. Love! Yeah. Oh my gosh! I finally found you! I traveled all the way across town just to meet you! I'm a huge fan. Such an honor to see you in person. Uh-oh. Is she gonna give me a kiss? Is she gonna take the flowers? Stop making that sound, please. I like how they're not showing the full body yet, kind of.
I can't believe it. Love is... Love is standing right in front of me. I'm speechless. What the fuck? You look so much taller in, in your music videos. Hot. Oh, a fan. I absolutely love my fans. Yes. It's me. World famous celebrity love. The giraffe. Thank you for the compliments. Love! I, uh... I got you these flowers! Why, thank you. How kind. They are lovely. <laughs> Lovely, lovely, lovely. Roses. Hey. <laughs> it's kinda cold out here. Do you wanna come inside? Dude's gonna skin me. Wow. Oh my gosh! Really? You're inviting me in? I can't believe this is happening! I'm so excited! Um, well, I mean... Yes! <clears throat> Sorry, I forgot his voice. I would love to come in! Great. I absolutely love hanging out with my fans. Please come in. Oh, how romantic. <laughs> Gonna hang out with love by the fire. Come in. Get warm. Wow, uh, nice place you got here. I really like the old creepy cabin style you're going for. Be honest. I know it's not what you would expect from a celebrity like me. But I like to live a simple life. Live a simple life. And not let the fame go to my head. D. <laughs> That's very humble of you. I really admire that, love. I watch you on TV all the time. I listen to your music every day. You're a real inspiration to me. Ah, stop it. You're making me blush. You silly goose. Why does everybody keep calling me different animals than I am? Please come in. Have a seat. So how long until the head falls off and it's revealed that that's the giraffe killer? Make yourself at home. Also, she has a big head compared to my tiny head. Huh. 
And that's an interesting painting you got there. Thanks, it's just some abstract art, nothing fancy. God, that voice hurts my throat. <laughs> Well, uh, you ain't right here, and I'll go get us some coffee. Coffee sounds great right now. Thanks, love. Be right back. <laughs> These fucking camera angles are killing me. You really like that picture, don't you? Yep, it's pretty nice. Oh my god. I can't skip this cutscene either. You know, I will admit something, love. Yeah. What's that? You do look a lot different in person than what you do on TV. See, well, that's just TV magic for you, my talented makeup artist. You also sound different in person than you do on TV. Oh yeah, I just have a really sore throat. Just got back from a live tour. Singing every night will do that to your voice. Right. Right. That is what happens. But you know, these are the dangers that we music artists expose ourselves to in order to please our fans. <coughs> Ow. Uh-huh. I hear ya. Door's right over there. <laughs> the fuck is this? No, he's not wearing a hat. It's just his hair. You ready for your coffee? Um, we're not really love, are you? We have to save the sun from dying out. This is the only way the beast can be stopped. Sorry, I used a fork. I couldn't find a knife anywhere. Oh, he's dismembering me. 
I was gonna wear my hat, or my head as a hat, I guess. Really could do without that sound. And on it, like in like in all honesty, it could do without it. Not my favorite. Oh, hey! <laughs> this should do it. Cool, so he killed me. Just straight up killed me. And so, is this the end of the game? Because I'm dead. So, when I start a new game or something like that, am I going to have the jumping shoes? Oh no! So that was my shoes. Or is the clown back? <laughs> Hello, it's me again. Tunnels, the clown. The time traveling clown. Just stopping by, check out my new friend. That's you, Mr. Giraffe. Why so sad, Mr. Giraffe? Mr. Giraffe? Mr. Giraffe. <laughs> You don't look so good, Mr. Giraffe. Uh-oh. You messed up in life, didn't you? Well, it's okay. Don't be sad. We all make mistakes. It's not the end of the world. As your friend, I'm here to comfort you. I like you, Mr. Giraffe. I really do. I think that you're a good person-animal. Looks like you've had a rough day. So how about a do-over? I'm gonna put you back in my apartment. I'll just send you back in time and you can restart your entire day with a fresh start. And... You can even keep the shoes! It's not gonna go, go up that other path. In the weird, rusty world. So, I was viciously murdered. That's, that's cool. Again with this interstellar stuff. It's so bizarre. This game is one of the weirdest I think I've played in a long time. It's definitely giving me like, potato thriller vibes. I don't hate it. <laughs> Not mad at all about it. Wish I could skip this part. So I'm back in time now. Hey! <sighs> oh, my controller's off. It turns off every five minutes if there's not an input. Okay, so now the phone's gonna ring.
Honk honk. What's in your trash can? Alright, I'm coming. Hello? 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 Alright, so we've seen this. Skip all that. He said if we come outside, then they're gonna kill me. Whose car is this? Car is on, but nobody's inside. The doors are locked. Whoa, hi! Shit. You're not going anywhere. <laughs> Stupid horse, what? Come on! Excuse me, I'm a giraffe! Wow, wow, wow. Just kick the shit out of me. Okay. So, where's that gonna put me now? Hi. Let's see where that put me. Hopefully it put me back in the house with the shoes. Okay, good. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Because now we know what happens if I leave. Some dudes in old school diving suits beat the shit out of me. Honk honk. Oh god. <laughs> Alright, skip all this shit. Sit and wait three hours? Fuck yeah. Okay, now it's midnight. Okay, so I have so I have to do the the TV thing. Okay. So the TV should turn on here in a second. What a weird game. This is what a what a weird, bizarre game. Yes. And skip all that cut that cutscene because that takes for fucking ever. Okay, there we go. Okay, so now that I can... I don't think I'm in whatever, whatever. Now that I can jump, I can do this part. Not that I want to. It's gonna suck. Hopefully it's not gonna be as long...
There we go. Sweet, look at this nightmare. <laughs> I feel like he kind of walks the limp, or like he's a little bit like to the right a little bit. You know what I mean? Uh, go down? Yeah, sure. Where am I? Am I in hell? What? Even a convenient place gun, uh, it looks like things are getting serious in this game. The gun has eight bullets in it. The ammo is displayed in the top right. Ammo might be hard to find in a place like this, so use it wisely. The action button, uh, to shoot your gun. Okay. Read Big Dog's Diary. <clears throat> getting colder and foggier every day. Something strange is going on in this town. I can feel it. I better keep my eyes open and keep track of what's going on. The days seem to be getting shorter and shorter. It gets dark within only a couple of hours. Doesn't seem natural. The sunlight feels so weak. I can't really explain it. It feels dim. It feels very dim. Like an old dying light bulb. Is it possible the sun is dying out? Now the ground feels like it's starting to change as well. Like it's shifting from place, from place almost. Notice that there are fewer uh, people in the town. Still not sure what exactly is happening yet. There's definitely something wrong here. It's freezing cold. The sun is only up for two hours. A large chunk of the town just broke off and fell into the darkness. I don't know where it went. It looks like it went into a bottomless pit. As the big dog of this town, it is my duty to launch a full, a full investigation and get to the bottom of all this. I won't let the town get destroyed, not on my watch. Keep my eyes peeled 24 seven, looking for causes of these suspicious and unnatural events in my hometown. Another large chunk of the town uh, broke off today. Why is this happening? Received a phone call from a suspicious number late at night. Mentioned something about a sacrifice for the beast. What does that even mean? With the recent events happening, I doubt it was a prank call. Immediately, I was asked for names and answers. These people on the other line threatened to kill me if I didn't uh, do as they said. They then told me that they are outside my house. Looked out the window to find a red van parked in my yard. Grabbed my handgun and rushed outside. These two men dressed in what looks like scuba suits came charging at me. Immediately, I pulled the trigger, shot and killed both of them. I was only protecting my yard. Didn't mean to kill them. I wanted answers. I rushed over and started shouting, What's going on in this town? Answer me, damn it! But it was too late. Fuck. Later, I uh, called the police to come and investigate their phone line, but their phone line was dead. The old police department was probably deep into the void at this point. It seems like no one else in the town except me. I'm not getting anywhere here. I'm starting to lose hope. I have no idea what's going on or why. There's barely anything left of the town. Every day, another piece <coughs> breaks off and falls into nothingness. The sun doesn't get any better either. It's practically dead at this point. Today, I disposed of the bodies, threw them into the, threw them off the ledge into the bottomless pit. No point anymore. I don't think I can save any more or uh, save my town anymore. A strange giraffe wearing red shoes came into town today. Said he was looking for the celebrity singer Love. He was able to find the town key that I had hidden. I kicked him in the nuts because he found it. No one has ever found the key before. <laughs> he didn't seem to be a troublemaker. Turns out he's legitimately looking for love. Seems like uh, a good animal. I saw something special in him. He has the potential to help save this world. I want to see him succeed. Something unusual happened the next day. A man wearing a creep, creepy group, uh, giraffe mask was in town. I questioned him and he said uh, he is here to save the sun from dying out. This is a big lead on, in my investigation. I followed him home later that evening and waited for him to leave so I can sneak in and investigate the head's house. I knew something strange was going on here. Found some kind of portal in the house. It brought me here. I don't know uh, what this place is or how we or how to go back. It might not even be possible to go back. The portal I came from isn't here anymore. This must be some kind of other world or dimension that is connected to our merging uh, to our to connected to or merging into our own world. Everything is silent here yet. 
I hear loud screams and roars coming from all over the place. I'm almost certain that there is something living here in this dimension and is somehow draining the sun's energy. I keep coming across some strange ass uh, otherworldly shit, uh, otherworldly shit in here. <laughs> Things I have never seen before. I have no idea what the what dimension this is, or what this dimension is, but I have a theory. I just to believe that this place is not just somehow connected to our world, it's connected to multiple other worlds, galaxies, universes, and dimensions across all of space and time. Oh my god, this note. Also, I don't think the portal I came from is the only one. I'm 100% sure but uh, that there is multiple portals spread all over. Uh, these were uh, these other worlds and dimensions which connect everything and everyone in existence. I believe that there are multiple ways to access these portals as well, but how? Are they man-made? Are they somehow naturally created? Are there multiple ways a portal can be made? Is it possible that there is even other people or life forms who already know about these portals and understand how to travel between them? Maybe there are... Okay. Shit. Let me do that. Okay, so I can't jump like that. Oh my god. Okay, so two kills them. Got it. Oh my god. Ow. Okay, got some bullets. Shit. Ow. No. No. Shit. Oh, this is bad. Oh, this is bad. Fuck. Damn it. Alright, so now that I know there's multiple ammo spots. Ah, oh, jeez. Now that I know there's multiple ammo spots, I'm just gonna start killing the ghosts as soon as they get, as soon as they get near me. Key? Fuck yeah. Nice. Thing's huge, too. Fuck. No. No. So as soon as they hit me, they fuck off. That's good. At least. Okay, so I know where the house key is. I have to retry this. Fuck! Damn it. Okay, so I got the gate key and the house key. So I think I'm good. I think I made it. So this is the house where I got got at. Oh, I got forked in the knife, or forked in the neck. There we go. I almost said forked in the knife. Don't you ever fork me in my knife. Don't you ever. <laughs> Alright, what's up, buddy? Hope you brought your fork to a gunfight. Yikes. Hi. Oh, you're, you're already dead. Okay. I don't know. Is this the stand that's for my head? Feel strong force behind this wall. Oh, that's weird. I don't like that. 
don't like the head following me like that. Oh, hi! Take roses? Yeah. Let's go get the roses. Here, what are these pictures on the wall, actually? While I'm here. Are these the devs? These blurry-ass pictures of them. Don't cry, love! I got you some flowers! Here we go. I-I can't- I-I can't move! Yep. Later, love. Love you. Okay, bye. I am so confused by this game, but I love it. This has been a fucking ride. This is gonna be a long-ass video, too. I'll probably bust it up into two. Do Saturday and Sunday with these. We'll see. We'll see. Final save point. Boop your ball. Is there a soccer goal for you anywhere? And I can't even get it off the wall, so alright, whatever. Uh-huh. I don't even know what to expect with this. Okay. So I have five health. Ow. Ow. So I grabbed something shiny on the floor a second ago. What is this thing attacking me? I feel like I can jump out of the way of his attacks. I was picking up was ammo. I just pressed the shoot button, and then I could have shoot. I could have shot my shot. I could have shoot my shoot and shot my shot. What up, fucker? Where you at? There you are. Get fucked. Get some more bullets. Looks like it has little dick hands. Ow. 
Ow. Two hits in a row, that's not fair. As I, like, unload six bullets into him. Fuck! Even just, like, being, like, near him. Fucks me up. Damn it. God. Hi. So I've been fighting this final boss for an hour. An, an actual factual hour. I had to give myself infinite ammo so I could beat him. So I don't want to give a fuck. I don't give a fuck. Alright. I don't want to see any comments being like, Oh, you cheater! Uh, shut the fuck up. I just fought that guy for an hour. Alright? I played a, a giraffe town for four fucking hours today. Leave me alone. <laughs> Sorry, I'm pissed. Whew. That was abysmal. That was, that was honestly one of the worst experiences I've, experiences I've had in a game in a long time. Shit, 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 shit. Holy shit. Fuck. I think? I think it's dead. <laughs> Sorry, I'm trying to calm down again. Whew. God, that really made me mad. That really got me. I gotta get... I gotta get the fuck out of here! 100 bullets, I think, by the way. 100 bullets it took to, to take it down. No! No, 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 no! Start shooting, dude. Fuck no! Why don't you just fucking die? Hey! Right in time, big dog came in. Knock the fuck out of him. <laughs> so I pump him full of 100 bullets, and then big dog comes in, just punches him once, and he's dead. This game might have crushed my soul. 
Nice to see you again, giraffe. Who are you? Oh yeah, that's right. He died, so you didn't remember him. My name is Big Dog. I'm the guardian of our world. What? Big Dog? Really? Is that your, <laughs> is that your legal name? Giraffe, you once met in an alternate timeline. You kicked me in the balls, I remember. Say what? That doesn't matter now. Our world has fallen apart because this disgusting creature has been draining the energy from the sun. Our world's sun. This dimension is infinite and connected to even more infinite dimensions and alternate worlds. Our world is nothing but a small piece of existence in a never-ending reality of space and time. <sighs> Shit! It's gone! What do we do now, big dog? Over there! I thought he just froze. <laughs> Hi, buddy. Back for more? Aw. He's like timid. Oh. No, he's not. We're so fucked. Gorsh. Giraffe, when we first met each other in the alternate timeline, he asked me why my name is Big Dog. Well, you're about to find out. He's going to transform into something huge. Gross. I don't need to explain. I'll just show you. Uh, no thanks. I'm good, really. Yeah, strike that T-pose. Uh, what the fuck are you doing? T-pose. Yeah, we're fucked. <laughs> oh, now he's now he's got big boy bark. No. Oh. He actually turns into a really big dog. Hey, you beast. I'll try picking on someone your own size. Oh my god. Damn, he's about to throw down, too. Punch him in his big red belly. Or his stupid dick nose. Fight, you idiots. Fight! Spin kick! <laughs> this is my town! My dimension! I'm the big dog!
Amazing! <laughs> yep, time to deflate a bit. It's... It's over. It's finally over. Our world is safe now. Now, how do we get out of here? Not gonna warn him? Oh. Big dog, look out! Huh? <laughs> got got, nerd. No! Big dog! <laughs> wow. The sentient bus is dead. Holy shit! Hey everyone, I hope I'm not late for the wedding! Ugh. <laughs> uh. I... I don't think this is my stop. I'm just gonna... <laughs> I'm gonna go far away from here. Oh boy, oh boy. Ooh, look at these sweat stains. Yum. Oh, that's right, he didn't know him either. Who was that? <laughs> big dog? I'm hanging there, big dog, I'm coming. Big dog. Big dog. No oh, man, where are you, buddy? Big dog. Wow. Big dog, oh no. Top 10 saddest anime deaths. Please don't die, big dog. Come on, man, hang in there. Please. <laughs> You're a good animal, giraffe. You're a good boy. Do you remember when we first met? No, literally no. Wait, of course you don't. That was a stupid question, my bad. Anyway, I kicked you in the nuts. <laughs> it was pretty funny. I like how the draft is just look at him like, are you fucking serious? I had my doubts about you at first, but you proved to have potential. I told you that I wanted to see you succeed. I came all the way across town searching for love. Love. Love doesn't exist. It doesn't exist at all, man. But Success does. Oh my god. Come on. I. I saw you succeed, giraffe. I'm so proud of you. Giraffe. This place is directly connected to our world. 
please. I want you to protect this place. This. This is your town now. Oh, draft town. This is Giraffe Town. Goodbye, friend. No, big boy. Big was a big dog. Yeah, I almost called him big boy. So, oh my goodness. <laughs> oh wait, there's more. <clears throat> what a fucking journey this has been. Seriously, I can't believe I fought that boss for an hour. I'm so, I am so tired now. <laughs> Yep. Sure is dead. Where where is he going to walk? Like where is he going now? <laughs> okay. <laughs> My goodness. My, my goodness. Jeezy, creasy, lemon squeezy. That was a long ass game. That was weird as shit. This is gonna take forever to edit. So hey, please leave a like if you would. That'd be great. What's up, buddy? Did you make it to the wedding? <coughs> Directed by uh, Samir Khatib. Khatib? How do you say it? I get it, dude. You did everything. All right, let's jump to the end of the credits. I got up and used the restroom, came back. <clears throat> Special thanks to Samir Khatib. <laughs> it's funny. <laughs> yep. Oh boy. Overall, I would say I liked it. For what it was, like bizarre, somewhat ragey, horror-ish. I liked it a lot. Uh, the final boss though, oh my goodness. Without a doubt, one of the worst things I've experienced in video gaming in a long time. Long time, long, long time. All right, buddy, what are you doing? Just gonna sit there and watch the fire? The end. Aw, big dog, no. It's too sad. Too sad. Was that it? I think that was it. Alright guys, that was Giraffe Town. Thanks for watching, I hope you enjoyed. Uh, please leave a like. This took a long time to do, and it's gonna take a long time to edit. Uh, if you wanna consider Becoming a patron, that'd be neat as well. If you want to consider becoming a YouTube member, you can join my channel or whatever. It helps me out. Yeah. Or you can just 
leave a like and share this on Facebook and Twitter and stuff. That'd be great, too. Cool. All right. Well, thanks for watching, everybody. <laughs> Bye.